to increase <coughs> the class who are going to take uh, to study uh, the electrodynamics.
that uh, there is an upper bound uh, beyond which the signal cannot. So the any uh, interaction pouring effect uh, will uh, travels in the electromagnetic field within this bound. So these are known as local local fields. And if there is an in a spontaneous, so this actually discusses. You can imagine uh, previously people thought of uh, how to imagine, for example, Earth attracts Moon. For example, the, the effect of tides. So before how Maxwell tried to visualize like, or Faraday tried to visualize lines, fields in terms of lines of forces, people could not imagine how particles will affect other particles without any apparent. Uh, something, but there should be a rope by which you can change it. If there is a grid there, you can do it. But people could not imagine how at a distance, so people can move these lines of course. So that was actually at a distance. Even if there are uh, people, think there are invisible lines of forces, there are invisible gravitational lines of forces, or there are invisible uh, electromagnetic uh, lines of forces. Uh, acting from a distance, but still the question is at what rate do these uh, interactions happen? So special relativity power that uh, the upper bound is an experimental value. This is velocity of light. So no interaction in a field, in an electromagnetic field, can traverse. In principle, you can imagine fields, local, local fields. Uh, satisfy this uh, bound. But in principle, we can think of fields which may not be local, which can be always in the uh, term of non local fields, which we have in a spontaneously, if I do something, the charge will uh, feel the same effect exactly at that point at the interactions between non instantaneous. Uh, instantaneous. In local fields, the interaction will be non instantaneous. What would be? So this is uh, the how we basically uh, characterize uh, the definition of fields and how we try to imagine fields uh, uh, in terms of lines of forces or fields acting at a distance or fields maybe instantaneous. Okay. That's it. So these are and which correspond to local and non-local interactions. Okay. So that's the point. And these values come from the origins of the uh, special field. So before uh, I am going to say, but uh, I would rather finish the value of the and the points, but we should, uh, you should also do the, uh, since this is the uh, in class, we should, uh, we should also do the uh, area of the history of the values. In the late 1890s, uh, 19, late 18th century and earlier part of the 19th century. So there have been series of uh, these ideas to study in books, the standard book is Gridwood uh, or this uh, Jackson or Land, any standard book you study. So the ideas there are crystallized. So it is not that there have been various ideas, people agree on something, we do not decide to accept The interaction, the history of the electronics in this period is very uh, much. Uh, Worth exploring uh, as a part of this subject. So, how people did away with the idea of the uh, idea of ether? For example, uh, in the previous part, before Michael's Moniac experiment, people had a belief in there was some uh, undulating mediums, uh, because if it's sound waves or light water waves, and you will leave the medium to traverse. How could the light of the travels in medium? So people are postulating the uh, some sort of ether. With the advent of so but that ether model in Maxwell, I don't know Maxwell's equation for it, that Maxwell to time be to Maxwell's original theory that it was a model ether model. Even though later the theory said that the postulation of model of ether is not Necessary to explain uh, things of electromagnetism. Things of 
जो इथर मॉडल है इट्स नॉट नेसेसरी द एक्सपेरिमेंट डिड नॉट डिस्प्रूव इथर नी एक्जिस्टेड इट ओनली शोड दैट अंडर फर्स्ट ऑर्डर सम कंट्रीब्यूशन वी हैव नॉट फाउंड इथर वी हैव नॉट फाउंड व्हाट आर पॉइंट वो माय एक्सपेरिमेंट करते हैं जो फील्ड देखते हैं आप देखते हैं फील्ड एक्सपेरिमेंट करते हैं विच इज जस्ट फील्ड सो वी कुड नॉट फाइंड इथर so you can have uh, the uh, electromagnetic waves can also traverse in that they can also traverse in so the uh, model of ether model jo hamare paas tha to get back to this uh, being uh, made up of ether it was not a held uh, sacrosan or mess theek hai this this aap bhi hai ki before uh, Or Maxwell's fixed Ampere's law, okay, and using uh, those uh, theoretical constraints. You know, he's, he was the first in theoretical physicist in the sense he could theoretically believe in the consistency of equations, and he could draw a vector calculus in a term extra. And who extra term on this is who got that? Conservation of charge would be somehow avoided. Uh, so he proposed that there should be some uh, the, uh, the disturb jo hamare paas hai it should uh, have some physical characteristics usne usko naam diya displacement charge which was a uh, later uh, of from the previous but lab the birds the lab and if you are interested there is a particular from uh, grid why uh, in maxwell's times we are not able to observe the डोमिनेटेशन <laughs> दस पंद्रह बीस चालीस लोग चलेंगे उसमें एक ब्लैक कलर का कोई और कलर हो जाएगा ग्रीन नहीं दिख रहा मैक्सिमम सम ग्रीन ग्रीन यूनिटेड माइक्रोस्कोपिक आई ठीक है वो उसे देखेंगे ब्लैक तो सो हाउ टू हाउ टू मैनिफेस्ट जो मैक्सिमम डिस्प्लेस करंट वो हम क्यों नहीं ऑब्जर्व कर पाए Even though the point I want to emphasize is that for Maxwell, predicted <coughs> displacement current is purely for theoretical constraints. It's an experiment. It's like two things. You first prove a theory, and it has its own logic and you prove something. This means the theory is at that level. Yeah, or lab is at that level. By which you say that you have experimental experimentation, say you discover something. data a new one so science to develop the both these sometimes theory is a bit sometimes experiments are there sometimes theory gets the but match exactly when that match exactly to hum kehte perfect sense okay then our theoretical explanations and experimental explanations somehow uh, they uh, come together in the same okay जो 
the subjects like theory, dilemma, quantum electrical elements. Okay. So, so in those classical electrodynamics can be understood as a limiting case of quantum electrodynamics. Can be understood as a limiting case of quantum mechanics ka limiting case ka. In the same way, for we have in the higher class, we have Uh, the thing is that we say normally in books that classical mechanics as such is a very mathematically consistent thing. You say? You say? Mathematically. Consistent. Yeah. The problem is not. It's a mathematically consistent thing. There is no. Uh, what is the problem? The problem is that it doesn't agree with experience. It doesn't agree with experience. When we have a microscopic world, when we have a microscopic things go to the first form of experience. What do you think? So in the same way, we can take this argument here also. Since it's, we have talked about the good ideas, but it is a more specific idea. Class things are. So it's most of jaws and classical fields. Right? <coughs> so we can also say that when you go to its gross macroscopic features of charged particles, whether they are attached, whether they are in motion, we can study them on the classical fields. So but when charged particles, sub-microscopic charged particles, when the quantum effects become manifest, okay? We have to replace this classical electromagnetic field with quantum electromagnetic field. Okay. And the other thing which I want to emphasize in classical and quantum is other things school. Mathematically, we see classical way is that a particle can be principally take any value. It's like number line thing. If you two points are infinite points, but Quantum mechanics, you can only have certain eigenvalues, you know? discrete values of the observable effects on a given uh, observation. That will correspond to a given value, the eigenvalue of the observation. The value is All the rules are exhausted. Only certain values uh, get exhausted. But since we are concentrating on uh, class, we are going to keep the dense of that. Okay. So that's the thing. Now, in this way, we can also I'll just leave this thing here. How in quantum dynamics, so if you hear how in quantum electrodynamics, the idea of gauge symmetry of the amount, and gauge symmetry to break the message, we can also uh, arrive at the classical uh, field, classical notion of electric field. So I leave it and study it. Uh, so how classical electromagnetic field is a limiting case of quantum electrodynamics. Okay? Usme kaise hum gauge symmetry ko break karne se how to arrive at for photon ka mass hum zero. So this uh, I should. Uh,
इट इज एज इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक फील्ड में जब हम मूव करते हैं तो चार्ज फील्ड में अपना एक फोर्स होता है तो पीपल यूज टू उसको हम कैसे अकाउंट करेंगे हम उसको कैसे अकाउंट करेंगे ठीक है सो दिस इज Oh, 
Mikhaes Güç Azat Ziyarı İmkosu'nu ne? Bu ülke sizinle bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke yani bu ülke और अगर आप जो फैमिली जो जैक्सन है ना जैक्सन फर्स्ट चैप्टर जैक्सन का होगा ठीक है दैट इज द सम और यू वांट इट एंड वन थिंग आई हैव लेफ्ट इज जो इज अ वेरी गुड डिस्कशन इन जो मनवर आस्ट देयर लॉ इन पूलम स्टोर हाउ यू कैन हैव अ अराइवल एट दैट वेरी वेरी डिस्कशन फ्रॉम योर आस्ट एक्सपेरिमेंटल जो है सिंपल स्फीयर सिफर के ऊपर देर हैव टू बीज अटेंशन टू इट्स कैलेंडर ठीक है तो फिर इसको 